Hello everybody, welcome to a blue-white control video. People love blue-white control. I decided to bring it to the channel with Leland Binding. You'll be like, man, go stop playing Leland Binding in every deck. No, come on, I'm a content creator. I need to play the new cards. What do you want me to play? Old cards? No, 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 no. We play new cards here all the time because magic is an ever-changing, ever-changing, like evolving game and playing new cards cool. Play Leland Binding in every archetype. I was missing to play it in blue-white control, so here we are. One mana, exact target spell, flash, blah blah blah. You have black with Raffine Tower, red with Rogarin Triumph, green with Breeding Pool. You have Prismatic Ending also to help your rainbow mana base. You of course have uh, 25 lands, all the Storm Giants, and I still call them a couple of Castle of Interest. Uh, this is the version with uh, Giganta, sorry, not Giganta, Kahira in the side. No, um, no Snapcaster Mage opt, but instead Chalice of the Void. One dress domain three in the side subtlety is a very well-rounded list. This list uh, came pantheon modern challenge. Not an amazing result, but still new deck. Well, let's go. Let's go. New card pog. Sharky shark four Hollywood moonlight in the sideboard. It's a lot of. Hollow Moonlight. The Crazy Dentist is our opponent. Keep, 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 keep. Thank you, Pullum. Strongest standard deck at the moment. I'm not a big standard fan right now, but you can check out the podcast where we talk about standard all the time. Um, Let's say not all the time. Uh, Every week for like 20 minutes Esper I think it's best once I played it last time I played standard was during the new Capena championship and I played Esper so I will suggest to play Esper uh do I bottom what do I bottom here I bottom Leyland binding <laughs> that's weird right because I'm trying it out but... I already have a removal spell Teferi on the play. I don't, I don't want a bottom Jace. Don't I like Wandering Emperor? Uh, honest questions? No, I don't like Wandering Emperor. I think it's not a good card. I think it's overhyped in modern. In, whenever I play against it in modern, it doesn't seem like a good card to me. In Pioneer, sure, but in modern, it's not good enough, I think. All right. Uh, gotta try him. Go. You have a podcast available on other platforms as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every should be on every platform. If you have a platform that the podcast doesn't feature on, tell me. I'll I'll make it be there. Okay, playing as Blue and Merc Tide should be a good matchup, but obviously if I miss a land drop, it will be a bad matchup. All right, not a good matchup, but it's a good matchup. I play John Dwayne Grace. You can find it on the channel as well. Ragaban, not bad. Now. I go Island, Charm, draw two cards. Appears? No. Draw. Play ending on Ragaban. A hole and pass. Right, if my fourth land and pass, their hand must be like a lot of bolts and uh, unknown heat and such.
I'll fight over this. They, they might spell pierce this now, it's okay. Like, it's not that I... I tap out and there is all a spell that's unbeatable. The unbeatable spell would just be the um, expressive iteration, so I don't mind. And now I minus because if I don't minus, they go unlead and kill my Teferi. Will I make a guy for blue white? I don't think so. I don't think so. No. Does anyone have the, the zoo list? Yes, exclamation mark deck will bring you to every deck and then you save that link because I play every deck all the time. You tried to look for the podcast on ebooks. Wow, ebooks, never heard of that. Do many people use it or is it just uh, yours? Fairy. A bounce channeler. Three mana. You draw two cards. You wanna counter? I didn't I counter spell again. I don't mind to counter spell again. And then I bounce the channeler. Use ebooks too. Wow, really? All right, I'll uh, I'll write it down and then I'll figure it out. Ebooks, but the R S is uh, on the link, I think. So. Can I ask a pioneer question? Sure, I mean asking is free. Is blue red still good? Yes, I mean this is uh, always been a bad matchup for blue red. Any bolt in my fairy. Mm -hmm. Shore up. Also known as La Merda. I like the picture though. huge card advantage for me like every teferi who is bounce the thing draw a card eat a removal spell the, the... Am, am i in delirium yes prevail first i'll steal your channeler They have one card in end. This matchup is bad, and if you draw, if you don't, no, they stole back the the channeler. Rude. Rude. Stealing is not nice. They say. It's true. It's true. Eh, Bo, I just go chache. Do I pick up? I pick up. Counter target spell. Nah, you draw counter spell. No, no, peta, peta, peta. No, I should have returned Kaera. No, Kaera, you could have been in my hand. I'm sorry, Kaera. I didn't mean to. No, let's put it on the bottom. Put it to the bottom. I don't know how I'm, how I'm playing right now. I'm in the clicking bottom phase. You want to have this side, the invoke despair against Rakdos, sure. Why not? Good murky tide. 
Also, they have 16 cards in the graveyard, no delirium. That's a little bit unlucky, isn't it? Ma come, opponent? Ma che me fai? Ok. That shame concession? No shame concession yet. It takes a lot of uh, it takes a lot of force of will to not shame concede there. Congrats, opponent. I could be brainstorming, but plus two it's easier to resolve than brainstorming. You get into those games where it's so over, and plus two is just the easier, the faster way. And while it's not correct and you should brainstorm, it's just faster. Also, usually makes opponent concede. All right, they conceded. Hmm. We can do this. Yeah. How is blue white binding looking? We won the first game, so we have a hundred percent win rate, best deck in the format. Yeah, there's nothing sadder than having the opponent fate seal and then they leave it there. Such a pleasure to have the prismatic ending for when they go turn one a ragaban. It also makes you feel very lucky too, because like if you don't have turn one ending, you'll just lose the game. <laughs> but you do have it, so you win the game. On Cedar. How long will I be in Texas for? Hello, Frank the Third. Uh, it's exciting because I'm coming soon, right? I'll leave. Uh, um, I'll arrive in Tech. I'll arrive in Dallas at the on Thursday. On Thursday, at Aspiring Spike uh, House, and then uh, I'm gonna play all the side events, all the main events, and then on Monday I fly back. You exile counter spell? Unlucky. Ooh, Chalice of the Void. Oh, I don't want to cast it though. One is fetching basics and they have uh they have Blood Moon against me. People complain about white? I don't know, you can complain about anything. This is this is competitive magic. Your goal is to build the best deck and win with it. If you instead choose to complain, it's fine. It's a fine choice. It's a fine route. But playing with the cards you'll dealt with is the best approach. Oh, magna questo. Bolt me? Why you still have Bolt in your deck? No, vabbè, double Bolt, madonna mia. 
Blood Moon is very good, yes. Yeah, I can't wait. I can't wait to go to, to America again. It's been over two years. I mean, back in the days, I used to travel so much. I used to travel so much. I don't know. I guess I'll play at the ferry. I told you, the game just ended when I uh, killed a Ragavan. If I didn't, I would have probably lost. I did, and you win. It's that easy. Chison 2? No, because they uh, have uh, explosives. They have engineered explosives. If you go Chison 2, they just go explosives. It's bad. You know what's not bad? The fairy here of Dominaria. The fairy tick up. GG. 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 Do you have a favorite food to eat when in the US? I mean, in Dallas, I uh, will. Oh, Kaboya. I got the fairy. In Dallas, I will uh, uh, love to eat. Um... GG. In Dallas, I love to eat the the the, the meat. The BBQ meat. That's definitely one of the things that I look forward to. Yeah. Very precious. Also, another thing is the <laughs> the so uh, you know I remember there was an airport. I don't remember if it was. Uh, At I think it was Atlanta. They had uh, this like fried. Um, Fried, uh, fried fast food, something like, uh, I think it was something like Louisiana, I might be wrong, yeah, but like Louisiana chicken, something like that, and the, uh, I don't know, the, <laughs> that's not something that we have, so, while it's not uh, the best one, it's definitely an experience that you only get in America. Popeyes, yes, you're right, Popeyes, that was the name. Okay, look at that, I five color, man. Yes. Noble Arc. Hmm. Should I play Zoo? I play Zoo chat. They saw my video with Zoo and they play Zoo. Is there KFC in Italy? There isn't. Also remember going to KFC in London and it was the worst food I've ever eaten in my life. Oh, maybe KFC is in Rome, Milan. I don't know about those places. But it's definitely not nearly as close as the, as the one in America. Hmm. Wanna steal the Hark? No. Milan, Rome, Naples, right, okay, yeah. I mean, sure, in big cities, there might be those chains, but in my, in my town, for example, or around here, there's very little chain. It's not a lot, right? Can you just cascade like a lightning helix, please? Ignore the arc. That would work. Actually, I think I want to draw two cards. Eh, that's five damage. No, I'm countering it. Oh, 
Porca Evo, mi è stato il turno. Vaffanculo, mi è stato il turno. Chat, porca Evo, mi è stato il turno. Vaffanculo, mi è stato il turno. Porca puttana, porca puttana, porca puttana, porca puttana. Eh, yeah, buona, I lost. Two tilted to, con to continue. I know I have Supreme Verdict. Two tilted to continue. Okay. That's all. I'm gonna win post that, but don't worry. Uh -uh. Do I want some more cards? Oh, Alouette Moonlight works against Cascade, right? No, it doesn't. Never mind. I'm subtlety in this matchup. It doesn't seem good, honestly. Yeah, because it was in upkeep, I clicked six and I died. Uh, Live the first, yes. Mm, all right, keep. Our moonlight is for crashing full falls, living again, or creativity, looks like this. Go. Can you please play the the Kavu? I would like to cryptic command it. Can you play the Kavu? Yes, there's a way to stop F6 if you hit it. It's the number five. Kavu? I'll take a screenshot to this. Because this is a nice feeling. Cryptic command. That's what we're doing here. We successfully um, baited our opponent into registering territory Cabo and then played a deck with four dress down. This is what I call metagaming. This is what I call metagaming. Scion of the Dragon. I'll counter it. Ragaban? Wait a second. That one wasn't in the original list. Opponent, are you making a new... Are you making a new deck list by any chance? I don't think it's legal. I don't think it's legal to make changes to a deck list. Somebody call the police, please. What is breaking the laws of Magic Online? Lobbert Elf. Unfortunately, the rest down doesn't stop Lobbert Elf. Lining board. A board. I think I want to steal the Ragaban. And then I want to tap with it. So that I can play my Teferi. Maybe the Delusion Poklanki, to be honest. Should have side it out, probably. Or I can just go for a Solitude. No, that is go to Teferi.
Raga, ban. No, oh, un'altra elfa. Porca Eva. Relax, opponent. Travel flames? Oh, my Teferi. I'll go dress down to remove haste. Elaine Binding, that's one mana. Uno chat. Uno mana only. Airy Bounce Elf. I think I pass now. Because the elf doesn't cascade anymore. White? White. Okay. We give this first strike. Trample. Two cards in your hand. One is uh, the Blood Braid. GG. GG, Michael. On the draw, do I want the subtlety? I think so. Memory Deluge is poo poo. Chich also poo poo. Let's go. No, they can't cascade. They have to fear in play. Alright, we got dressed down. Best card against them. Hache. Ace, mi piace. What makes the land better over Chalice? Well, they're different cards. I don't know. This is a removal spell. Chalice stops very, very few cards from them. No, they don't cascade. Just play, just play the Cavu. Just play a very friendly Cavu card. Cavu? Cavu? Vu vu vu, unka vu, lining helix. Divert. That was actually lining helix chat. A good old sorcery speed lining helix. This is the blob raid. Unfortunately, dress down doesn't stop blob raid. Would you cascade? Just cascade another burn spell, please. Er, cripple you. That's big. Va bene, dai, okay. Draw. With you, counter spell, but I also just wanted to draw a card with Dress Down. Dress Da. Three mana Lila in binding anyone? Come on, Pepengu, let's draw. Una casa di terra, dai. Land, 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 land. Land, land, land. No, too strong. Burn, burn, burn spell. Nice, bold, okay. Draw. Die terra 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 flames. Ah. Check his feet up at all. I kept the three lander. I drew like I don't know six cards.
Wait for two, down to two. Then I'm dead to anything. Zoo too strong, chat. Zoo too strong. Right, Kaya. Keep. Zoo too strong, please ban. Right. No, this matter base is much different than. Oh, oh, you mean the normal blue eye control plays at breeding pool and just get try them anyway because of the ending? Yeah. Yeah, it's a new card. It's probably not worth it in this deck, but it's also probably not worth to play this deck over another deck. But still, trying new cards and can't hurt that much. Mm -hmm. Ornithopter, Giver of Runes, Paradise Mantle. Worth a try, yeah, exactly. No land? That doesn't seem like a good end. I guess it mulligan to six. Eferone, Paperone. Inked by wife, thank you for the 11 months, almost one year, thank you so much. Man, I love Dress Down, I love Dress Down, Fury card. Te ferino, oh, te ferino, oh, oh. Te ferino, oh, oh. I want to build every deck with the fear in my deck. And if possible, also Brand and Six. Well, if you do that, you're gonna get. You're gonna get a lot of free wins with a card like Teferi. Just, just look how good it is. We played it. Now they can't. Luxmith Skills, Fell Pierce, Sigarda's Aid. They have to attack it, but its loyalty is so high. So high that they will never take it down and while they struggle to get it down you will just take over the game in the meanwhile anyway they managed to play a stoneforge mystic now the results of the attack are complete okay draw
Your Bruins is a little bit annoying. I think I want a minus three to Fairy, actually. Because next turn they violate the Kadra, I want to solid shit it. Put a mulligan to six. What the fairy is? Is that better than Jace? I kind of want to just go Jace here. And pitch the fairy to Solitude. Yeah. Long. I pitched the fairy. The the big the fairy. Vigo Solitude in there. Solitude in there. I don't know. Do Zack 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 Yeah, I had a bad card on top, so I fetched. Counter target spell. The combo to fairy counter spell. Very strong. And I, I, I forgot how many choices does uh, does this deck put you through. It's a lot, a lot of a lot of options, eh? A lot of options, and I'm just making them in a weird way. I'm not saying that how I play it right. It's probably just caring because the cards are so strong. But um, yeah, a lot of options. The in comparison to the five color zoo, which played by itself. Honestly, I just curved out the fairy Jace the fairy. That that was good. Throw out the fairy for my Jace. Five out the fairy. La 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 la. I don't really know what I'm doing, chat, okay? I reached the stage in the game which I'd like to call bottle, button clicking. Okay. So this is the stage of the game where we don't ask anymore. Hey, Pepang, why you play that way? Okay. I am just trying to close the game as soon as possible now. Just don't skip turns. Okay. I'll try not to skip any turns. 
la sole to be made too strong. I exile this and that. This is what we call three for one. That poem and basta così. Let's give up. Let's give up. Do it for you. Do it for me. No? You don't want to give up? Okay. Click clack. Click clack. This this game this deck reminds me of Sperone in standard. You're so far ahead, but it takes you like five turns to win. Be a long time since you've seen a Jace Ultimate. It's actually my it's my way to close the game. I always when the game is over, I always start taking up Jace. Because attacking actually takes a long time. What's my professional opinion on my opponent using all different planes arts? I think you have to do anything uh, you want that uh, keeps you smart. So if if playing different mismatching art makes you smart, it's fine to me. The goal of our life is to feel smart. So you got to do what you got to do. Have to take and let's see five minutes. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I think I'm a pretty good control player. I used to play control a lot in the past. You want to try Hollywood Moonlight? You want. Uh, uh, what's it called? Um, Hollywood Moonlight in my creativity deck. Ooh, they start that way. Okay. I'm going to five and start with Saga. Paradise Mantle. Hmm. Not very good though, right? Can you level up the Saga? I, l I love the elementals. This makes makes being on the draw not as bad. Okay. Looks like my opponent does not have lands. After Mario into five. Now this is this is going to be a win. Even if they had uh, whatever, I had dressed down for the tokens. You love this deck, thank you. What do you think about Leyline of Sanctity? I don't like Leyline cards. I don't like the Leyline of the Void, Leyline of Sanctity. I think you don't need them. It's immutable, wow. That was a very sad, uh, where is this saga, huh? Madonna. Well, you draw land on the other hand. Limb binding, however. Opponent kept the one lander again. Yeah, then Madigan to five. I mean. Stoneforge Mystic. Nope. Nope, Teferino isn't good here. Because they have the needle. Oh, wow, I have eight cards. No, I have eight cards. All right, I'll discard. No, I have eight cards. I shouldn't have returned Kaera. All right, I'll discard uh, Teferino.
You think Ubu is a big brain deck? Yes, yes, it's a big brain deck. It is. It's just that it's both not very strong, so it actually needs to be played very well, and it is like very slow, so you need to have an attention for a longer time. Ledger Shredder. Ma yeah. Okay. Put a, a stone forge at the bottom. Oh wow. Do you have hammer? Huh? Or the thopter. Okay, that's not hammer. Better. And like you have to play fast. It's funny, I don't know if you uh, listened to the podcast already, but we talked about uh, the win rates at the GP Paris, uh, LMS Paris. Um, Blue White Control had a 49 win percentage, and one player went 12 1. The one player is a very strong player, Pachi Sanchez. So he's 12 1, made so that the other, I think it was like 15 players, had a combined still negative after his 12 1. We're gonna one card in hand is Zeta Hammer. It's not a hammer, okay. All right, brainstorms. Let's remove uh, two lands. I go fetch. Now I go solitude. Was I'm already top 16 at GP? I don't know. It's on MTG Melee. You can find lists on MTG Melee. He lost in the quarters. Yeah, I know. Yeah, tournament was won by Grexis Shadow with uh, the living end that was morphing into footfalls in the second place. You go blacksmith skill. Sorcery speed. I cast a judge. Yeah, the, the Spanish always did great, even in the past, in modern events. I remember the, I think it was GP Liverpool, right? It was a team modern unified where all three top eight teams were, were Spanish. I don't know what to do, chat. I don't know. I'll uh, I'll start. I'll start deciding my plan soon. And for now, I'm just clicking buttons. 
the classic. So basically, with black control, you have to keep up your your mindset, but you reach a stage where it doesn't matter anymore. But in the early game, you certainly have to piece it together. Then obviously you reach the stage, and it doesn't matter. But at the beginning, it does matter. I think. The league with Zoo went great. We went uh, four one, losing to Dredge. I'll keep on brainstormings. It's kind of fun to draw so many cards, knowing that your opponent can never win. Can I just say GG? in the chat do you think they'll concede i said gg in the chat let's see if they concede they don't concede whatever that bm thing let's just move on Unpolite, ma come on, unpolite, ma die. This is unpolite. Uh. Era, stringimi ancora. Archive the chart I found. Ah, okay. Dos uno. If you don't want to wait forever, don't play a deck that takes forever to win. Yeah, sure, but you're like incinerating your own time as well. That's the thing that I don't understand, the people that don't concede. Like, sure, you're like hate your opponent so much because they play blue-white control. But you're also, it's like you're also wasting. Control and chill? Yeah, yeah, no, I know. Magical line, you don't even have the timer. What if you don't value your time? That's true. That's true. I never thought about that. Okay. Let's see what matchup they play. Hunt 32. Oh, okay. It's that deck. Interesting. Hardened Scales immediately drew the best card against Hardened Scales. Where is the Saga? Okay. Anger Book Walker. The Chalice of Moon. Land Binding Performance Expected. 
it hasn't really performed yet. Strong draw. What do I bounce? I think I bounce the Ozolith because they can't recast it under the Teferi, under the Chalice. And also it's so annoying, so annoying. Next turn we can go Supreme Verdict. They will make tokens with Yanga back. Oh, I guess they get another Ozolith. Sure. The Welding Jar. Oh, wow. You got Welding Jar. Okay. Regenerate a construct, get the topter. I don't know if it was good to take Welding Jar, because I believe just got Ozolith there. They have five cards in hand, one of which is the Ozolith, and hopefully they have a bunch of more. What was that? Okay. I guess they don't have anything going on. Regenerate, yeah, regenerate puts you a shield counter. It's the same as it, similar as a shield counter. My opponent could have dealt me one damage of infect. I solitude, I'll exile the Thopter and I'll block the construct. They can make a token, and that's going to be a 3 3 regardless. Strong. Chosen 2. They're gonna make a bunch of constructs again. We have another Supreme Verdict. Let's see what they get this time with the Saga. They shouldn't be playing more than one Welding Jar. They do. Okay. Construct is just a 2-2. Two, two. I really don't think they can. I mean, I mean, maybe maybe they can. Maybe just more more Urza Saga is their way to play around my chalices. Chalice of the Void. 
when it has eight cards in end. It's a lot of cards. I wonder how many of these eight cards they can cast. Probably not very many. Emery Deluge. Le Deluge. Let's play Deluge. A charm land. Draw. This card of hand size. Oh, it's it's nice. It's nice to be sitting here as a blue eye control player, knowing that nothing bad can happen to you. It's a nice feeling. I have to say it's a very relaxing league. It's a very relaxing league. You feel I have to say you feel you feel very very powerful playing this deck. Even if today like you don't win most matches, you still feel very powerful. You have to stay focused? Never. Honestly, you have to stay focused in the like first turns of the game and then you can just switch off your brain with this deck. I think I don't want to take out Jace because this one can bounce like an Angerbrook Walker with a lot of counters on it. This game is brought to you by Chalice of the Void. I would Moonlight. You know what? I'm a believer. I'm a believer. Of the moonlight. I want to be a moonlight believer. Let's see how this card performs. Because it stops both the top turns from Manga back and the construct from Saga. No rest in peace. Yeah, it's not put in the sideboard so you don't get trapped into sighted in. Subtlety for constructs. Subtlety <laughs> does not do what you think it does. <laughs> It's not a 4 mana 3 3 Aether Snipe. Okay. Carpoison Forest. Ozolito, very good. So funnily enough, I've never cycled a single Triumph. Without a uh, random six in your deck, the deck is just mana hungry. You don't have a billion lands like you do with random ticks. Oh, this is strong. Patrick Automaton is a good card. Kitchen steerings. Okay, so they don't have lands. Lightning jar. 
Wow. Alberta loves welding jar so much. There's a buzz. Okay. Dress down end of turn. Whoa. Whoa. What a sequ sequence of draws. Huh? Eh? Amazing. I can go ending on the Ozolith. Ah, uh, actually. Hmm. I really, ah, it was just so good, so good. That's fine, let's do this. I'll just go uh, Esper Trium, a Lilian Binding on the Automaton. And you just move the counters on the Ozolith, that's okay. Doesn't have ward because we removed the redress down. Or my efficient next round I can go to fairy ending. If I had a temple garden, I could have gone both automaton, a uh, binding and ending, but I I don't. So I was thinking I was going to braiding pull, but then I have double white. Why not dress down in response to Zabaz? I had to play dress down end of turn. So I wanted to remove a thaumaton to kill it with the ending or the fairy. Conan uh, obviously has to decide what to get here. You know, not ending the Ozolith is fine because now they don't get their Ozolith. They get draw, makes sense. They didn't have land last turn. They drew a land though, so they have four mana. Hardened Scales. They have two cards in end. So Hardened Scales will mean that the Ozolith puts three counters on Zavaz. Uh. I have two cards, hopefully I don't have creatures. That's a very good creature, Falka Merda. And the Zabaz also can destroy it. Alua. For sure, I have to ending the Ozolith. That like has to happen. Now, Tamiya safekeeping. Madonna King Kulata. Tamiya safekeeping. And the fairy is now awful. It's awful. I'm like so dead. Eh, the Ozolith is broken. If I played the fairy first, I would have played her on Tamiya safekeeping. I mean.
I didn't know that. Time your safekeeping. What can I do? How's my Leyland binding? Huh. Solitude. I mean, they still have the Ozolid, so like anything I do won't matter. I guess I have to search as a buzz. They put four counters on this guy. But then I can exalt this one as well. And I think I have to search as a buzz. No way I win if I don't do this. So you put four counters on the Ozolith, but at least you don't do the modular thing. And now you don't have any sacrifice outlet. Hello, Bulky Kaiba. My nickname is uh, the previous owner's nickname. Do you mind a pot truck automaton? How much damage you have? Cinque, otto, dieci. I got a two. Yeah. Now maybe if I go to Fairy Deer, I win the game. If I go Teferi ending on Ozolith, maybe I win the game. I didn't play around uh, this card. What can I do? Okay. Not the worst. Not the worst. Lane. On the left. I'm dead on board. I'm dead on board. Is this ward fitting needle? Is it a castle? Okay, okay. Good game. Okay, that's fine. This matchup should be very good. I'm not gonna lose. I'm not gonna lose. Sorry, I would moonlight. You're not. You're not for this matchup. <laughs> Thank you for the prime sub. Turu, turu, tu, tu, tu. Buongiorno, Simone. Bonjour. I've colored the main zoo was good. We went 4 1. Good deck. I recommend it. <laughs> you playing domain since it came out in image two? I played it once on my on my videos, it was bad, but this list is, uh, was very strong, I think. Okay, gemstone cover, teaching her blues and forest. Okay. Interesting. 
So point of mulligans to six and stars to Jensen Kyra. So they have four cards in hand. Atrok Automaton, that's a strong card. We can set up the same play as earlier, which is Dress Down, Leland Binding. Turn one automaton. Remember, it's turn two. My opponent stole the play. They have two cards in end. Arkbar Ravager. So if I play Dress Down now, this dies. If I play it end of turn, then I can't steal this because they... I can't steal it because they simply uh, don't have an ability. Should I Cryptic Command the Agma Ravager? Probably, right? Yeah, I probably should Cryptic Command the Agma Ravager. And then what about, what do we do about this? I don't know, but... That one seems like a good answer. Uh, I think I have to keep the ending for the automaton. And not for the hardened scales. Although maybe, considering that I can't just go breeding pool. Yeah, you know what? I'm actually exiling the... Uh, what if I don't care about this? They have one card in end. Let's try and let's try and ignore the Arden scales. Let's see how they'll go. Two cards in hand for them. Yozolith. All right, this is more problematic than Arden scales. Please don't have time your safe keeping. Please don't have time your safe keeping. Please don't have time your safe keeping. One card in your hand. Don't have time your safe keeping. Okay. Next turn I can go Breeding Pool, Teferi, Binding. Nice. Die, that's the win. That's the win now. That's the win now. They don't have a creature. Go Breeding Pool, and now I can play Binding for 2 mana. So I just go Teferone, Tick Up, and then I have Binding open mana. And, bye bye, basta. GG. We win. Congrats. 3 1. Heads. Clap. Mangu. Alright. Bonjour, Cornuil. Vamos. Again, with this deck, you have to ship up the first four turns and then easy mode. Still cruise what I meant by steal it. Did I say steal it? I probably used the wrong word. On the play. Charles of the I want Charles of the Void. Thank you. When well, I suspend crashing footfalls on turn one, please. Haven't played against Rhinos in a long time. Just suspend footfalls. Be nice. Forest. Look at my forest. I'm not sweating.
think they might have Blood Moon in their deck. I could Prismatic Ending this, but I think I want to wait. Bonjour, Alfred. You don't know a single card? <laughs> Are you not a Verona? Ooh, they have Blood Moon. That's nice. I managed to play around it. Well, I would say. Okay, I have to decide what to do. I could just ending the Blood Moon. But I think I pass. I have my Lila Binding Bond up. You have three types. And thank god I changed the fetch land last second there. Okay. Spyro. Arbor of Lightning Bolt. Okay. It's a lot of people. No lands for Pepengu. Do I exile this? Why not? I don't have much else to do. Might as well do that. I could have returned Kahira, I decided not to. The fiddle name. Eh? No, vabbè, Vivian Reed. GG opponent. You win. When the player with blue eye control meets the player with Vivian Reed. The player with Vivian Reed wins the game. Vivian Reed Duke. What a card. <laughs> oh, this is bad. I don't know. I feel like I take Mount Memory Delusion against everyone. I guess you could say I don't like it very much. Classic Ravnica Legion Standard. I know. I finished uh, 12th place of the Ravnica Legion's PT with uh, three Vivian Reed in my main deck. Lost the winning into the Wildness Reclamation. Um, I should have played the other Raven Trion, that was a mistake. Hello, DBR. How's it going? How has Deluge performed? Not great. I can't cast Leyline Binding on turn 3. I should have definitely played Rogue and Trial on turn 1. Rain 6 is very hard to beat. I mean, obviously, you can Leyline Bind in it, but. <laughs> the way I. The way I fetched. My next turn, I guess, I can Leyline Bind in it. What would I play modern? Uh, creativity now. Uh, my last uh, video would be the deck that I play modern. Three mana? What's that? Spyro, Cats, I wish I had this dress down mine up now. No, the bear. Carta Caso. Hmm. Not bad subtlety. I'll play. I'll play. So 
Now, if I don't play anything, my opponent's gonna play some stupid creatures and I subtlety it. Ah, è come Stomp. Ma porca merda. I play some stupid creatures, come on. I don't think they do it. That, I think, we lose. We should marry the Luigi instead of this now. Attenzione, te ferino. Don't attack Ren? Nah. Nah, go, go. I'll lay line binding the brand next turn. Goodbye, Tiferino. Prestige. Yeah, destroy my my dress down. When's that episode out? Yesterday, the podcast came out yesterday. What would you say the best deck in the moment right now is? Yeah, it could be creativity. Honestly, Just, I don't really see any weakness to that deck at the moment. Yeah, it's already out. Check it out for sure. No, the bear Clotis. Clotis. Also known as Clotis. Clotis. I think I'll attack Ren now. Spelled K LOL TIS. Alright, now that I'm opponent played Clothis, I can't lose anymore. Because I have a rule that was real since uh, Clothis standard that I can never lose to this card. It's like the same rule as with the Temple of Malice. Great says Shadow. You know, Grixis Shadow could be better than Murktide, honestly. Because Grixis Shadow doesn't really care that much about Leyland Binding. It's just a removal spell. I'll uh, attack Sandra. Yes. No, 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 no. What do you do? What do you do? Possess you. No, if I floated the mana. If I floated mana, could I play Lilian Binding instead of AF6? No. Chat. If I floated mana. I could have played Leyland Binding. The moon is red. What's that? 
blood braid. Madonna che cade a casa, ragazzi. The moon is red again. There's no triumph that makes me binding for one mana. The land did not fight for us. I gotta think about it. I don't have uh, a way to cast double white because I only have one planes in my deck. I think that will be the coffin, please. Order. Ah. No, va bene, basta. Good game, opponent. At Clop, you have defeated me. Group Pega wins against the Uvu Control. Honestly, not much to say. If you like Blue Eye Control, it's a fine deck. I don't think Leyline Binding is worth it. Despite the cost is free, because we only added one Triumph to the mana base. I, I think you should probably play other cards. But yeah, I mean, Blue Eye Control is a fine deck. Um, not, much, not much to say, honestly. That's, hope you enjoyed the video.